forwarded to an automatic voice message system. At the tone, please record your message. I swear. Okay, let's proceed. Yeah, I was at the party, but I was with my friend the entire night. I barely even spoke to her. And did you have a prior relationship with the plaintiff? Uh, I mean, we're in the same class. I heard from someone she fancied me, but I hadn't had any contact with her. I may have talked to her a few times at the party, but I mean, I can't say that with confidence. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. I do recall my friend and Casey going to the bedroom together. But he was just trying to help her out because she was like severely intoxicated. She wasn't in a good state. Did you see him put her to bed? Well, no, not exactly. But I checked in on him not long after and he was just trying to make sure that she was okay. But according to multiple witnesses, it was another 10 minutes before you went upstairs to check on him. That's an awfully long time for a friend to be putting a girl to bed, is it not? It's my opinion that they were just talking. She was talking about him loads that night. The thing that she's accusing him of could be further from the truth. I saw him put her to bed. Listen to me. If this is your idea of some sick joke, it fucking stops right now. Leave me alone! Ah! <laughs> I remember he dragged me into his room. He, he said he was going to put me to bed. And was that not what he did? No. He put me into bed and then caught on top of me. So I... if he put you into bed, you can hear your testimony, put you on your side, which for anyone unfamiliar is the correct procedure when someone's intoxicated. Could you be severely choking on your own vomit? That's not why he did it. He did it so he could... Right, multiple witnesses state that you expressed you were going to be sick moments before you took you upstairs, did you not? Yes, I did express that, but that's not why he did it. He put me on his side, so it was easier to hold me down. Miss Bishop, did you also not express to various friends before my client took you upstairs how attractive you thought he was, and in quotes, how bad you wanted him? I did not want to have sex with him. I was drunk. I didn't ask for it. 
He held me to hand and I said no. Fair question, Miss Richards. Did you or did you not express to various friends that night that you had intentions of getting with my clients? No. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Casey. I shouldn't have lied. I shouldn't have let him do what he did to you. You still can't admit it. Can you? I'm sorry, Casey. I'm so, so sorry. You don't know how sorry I am. Please. Ah! Just let it happen. You're ruining it for me. No. I'm sorry. Casey, I'm so, so sorry. Please. I didn't want this to happen, okay? I hate myself. I'm so, so sorry. Please. Please. I'm so sorry. Please. 